I have this in my chair to review today, hence the funny camera angle. This is the Tower Aluminium 14 set starter kit for the kitchen. Um, and it comes really nicely well packaged in this you know, nice box. That's going to be an easy thing to wrap if you're handing it to someone. Uh, it's going to be very easy for a student to take to their new halls with them. Um, and, and you can pack things all back up when you're done. So I thought together we'd take a quick look inside. So you've got two very simple tabs to open and we're in. And we have a little three-year guarantee. There you go. So you have a three-year guarantee. Um, it is directly with the vendor, with Tower, and it comes with all the information you need to know. Now, the first thing I'm going to say is it says aluminium set, but these are obviously plastic. These are plastic utensils, so you have a, a spoon, a label, you have a masher, which, to be honest, is okay. But I'm going to say this about the masher. These little runners, they're going to pick up potato. You're really going to need to wash that out well. Um, probably not the best thing for a lazy uh, chef, but it's okay for me. And then you have a, a, a filtered spoon. And further down, we have another little piece of tower. Uh, an advert for their electrical wares. I'm trying to pick through the right things. So then we have a box. We actually have two of these. So they're two separate boxes. Okay, and these have blades in them. So I'm going to be careful. There's a can opener. Okay, now, as can openers go, it's got a nice angle. I noticed this earlier. Um, you've got the nice sort of hold angle. Obviously, it isn't going to work brilliantly for a left-handed person, but for a right-handed person, that is really quite nice. It's a bit rough and ready. This The finish on it isn't fantastic. I don't know if you can tell, but it is aluminium, but it's not the most fantastic of aluminium. Um, I would say that would rust in a dishwasher and wouldn't recommend putting it in a dishwasher. Um, but that's just me. I, I just don't put blades in dishwashers. So I can avoid it. And this one is the blades. So, pizza cutter, a large pizza cutter, I'll be honest, that is a large pizza cutter, that is very useful. Uh, scissors, and the scissors have the grip here, the grip holder, or the you know, nutcracker, or nutmeg scrapper. They don't feel terrible, um, they're not the best in the world, but they are certainly functional. Uh, but there is a bit of a gap between them, I'll give them that, there's a bit of a gap. I do hope this is all on camera because I'm doing this stood up. The blades, the knives themselves come with uh, covers on them, but there are two quite nice knives. And that has got quite an edge on it, and there's a protective cover on the tip. I'm, I'm so far, I'm impressed, but these aren't the reasons that you buy this kit at all. Uh, the actual reasons are the pans. Oh, can't get it out. start with the oven pan. So we have three oven pans. You've got a flat baking uh, tray, which is a you know, baking sheet, and then two dip sheets. Okay, now we're going to go for the largest one first. And it does say on all of them, warning, avoid dangerous suffocation. That's fair enough. That feels like a decent pan. That feels like, I mean, I can imagine buying that um, supermarket prices, four or five quid on its own. Um, I can imagine that in a, a, re, you know, a pound shop, going for maybe more than a pound, ironically enough. Um, they're not bad. These are not bad quality um, oven pans, oven trays at all. Um, obviously, the three together really make it useful. And then we have a small frying pan. It isn't a huge frying pan. It is a small frying pan. Uh, there is a non-stick coating of sorts on there, but it isn't a Teflon. It isn't anything else like that. It is just like an enamel sort of cover. Um, this probably won't be as hardy as you might want it to be. Um, but it, it does talk about the induction, electrical, gas or ceramic. Basically good for all hob types. And then the final bit is a lid. And there are two pans. Um, again, the lid is inside this pan. That's how they come packed. Pretty well packed. They're not uh, going to wrap around at all. And then, again, though, it isn't a sort of anti-stick. It's just a ceramic cover as per the frying pan. It's the same on all of them. They're very similar to each other. Uh, halogen, 
induction hob, electrical, gas or ceramic. I think all in all, they feel very nice. And again, as with the can opener, the handles have got this rubberized effect. You've got a nice thumb pick. Um, these are going to be useful and just a simple screw to tighten them back up when they inevitably get loose as they do over time. Um, I would again say perfect starter kit for a couple, perfect starter kit for a student going on their uh, jollies uh, to halls or whatever. I think this is a really nice set. And it's not even £40. That's everything you need to set up the start of a cooking kitchen for less than £40. I think this is a job on bargain and I think I'm going to enjoy using these utensils. So that's me for now and any odd camera angles, I can only apologise. Bye bye.